I'm here with another video. Uh, today, I'm going to show y'all me pre-pooing. Well, not pre-pooing, like deep conditioning. Um, right now, pre-pooing, I already have my last video that I showed y'all pre-pooing, um, which I actually took that in March of this year. This is May of this year, so it's two months. And right now, me wetting my hair, this is how much it's grown. So this is a year, February, March, April. It's a year and three months of growth up here. And I've started on this section right now to kind of pre-poo it, but I will be showing you the deep conditioner I'm using next. Um, and the process of what I'm gonna go through to deep condition it, because I feel like it needs some deep conditioning like and some moisture before I get a protective style again actually this time my best friend is doing my protective style I'm getting full locks soft locks one of those locks she's doing it I'm taking my hair out now so I can just head up there she actually lives in Charlotte and she's going to do my hair um yeah she's going to do my hair um Thursday and Friday um just around the clock I love it. just want to tell to let y'all know that that's what i'm doing hey y'all i just finished washing my hair so i have one section out already um i use this shampoo right here if you can see i use this shampoo which was really good like it was very it had a lot of slip i'm deep conditioning oh let me show y'all again this is what I'm deep conditioning with. It's the same line as the shampoo, Shea Moisture shampoo. Oh no. And then this one is just the Hydrate and Repair Protein Power Treatment. That's what I'm doing right now. I'm wetting my hair right now. Just prepare for me to deep condition. Since I already have this section out right now, I'm just gonna start with this one. I have hot water in here. I have my hair in like six sections just because of how, if you can see how big like up here is, bro. But I would say today was a really good wash day. I wanna see what time it is. So I'm gonna use this, I already have some hair in it. It's my detangler brush that I use while washing my hair. I know my hair is kinda crunchy. I had this same brush in the same, um, in my, not the same, but my last video. This is it. I haven't washed it. I haven't used it yet. It's dripping. I feel like I gotta do this. Oh god, it's so dry. Look at this. Oh god. I don't feel like I should be using my hair brush right now. Try to like pour this in. Here. Yeah, this is better. And then I'm gonna moisturize it a little bit more. No deep condition, but I kind of want it to be a little bit better when. See, I'm working at the ends all the way up. It's just this looks really good. Oh, I can't film it. All right, that's one like, section done. And and see back here, y'all. Back here is like pretty much grown. It's amazing. This is a year and three months. crunching is like my curl ends because I feel like they're steel. <laughs> I feel like they're steel. So that's what's crunching right now. Like if you notice like up here and then when I get down here, it crunches. So 
so right here you can see that I'm almost done with my section I'm applying the deep conditioner that I showed y'all before and I'm gonna go in praying hands with it so I can smooth through all of my hair then I go in with my brush start at the ends and work my way up you gotta do this go on with my other section and then you can see how much has grown too right here wow almost done applying some more right here and do the same exact method after i finish applying use that praying hand method it really works Going back, seeing like how my hair has grown. Cause right now I'm completely natural, cut off all my ends and seeing like this was like March of last year, 2021 and right now is like 2022. As you can see, like this process of me starting my YouTube channel has been a lot, but I'm here now, I'm slow to start, but Usually when I'm slow to start things, like, I pick up speed because I become more comfortable with it, and I've become more comfortable with my hair, and it's just, it's amazing. Y'all will see my journey. Like, it is literally a journey that will probably never stop. Right here, I'm finally on the other side of my hair. Of course, like, by this time, I am so tired. I'm really tired right now, so I'm just using bigger sections and but this side of my hair um that was over here is way more dense and I just at the end as you can see like I'm done with doing it like look at my face right here I'm done I'm I'm ready to be done deep conditioning but it gets a lot easier it does like I'm gonna say soon it's easier and easier to just handle. And I think that's what I wanted to transition to because I wanted to transition to know like gradually how it's going to feel like to be completely natural. Like if I would have just, you know what, I would have just cut it off too. It would have grown to be natural. So I don't know. I just transitioned. So right here, I'm almost done with my left side of my head, y'all's right. And you can see a little bit slip right here. That's what I'm trying to show y'all. And in some areas, it's just, I notice I have like so many different textures in my head. Different parts of my hair gets moisturized over other parts. It's kind of difficult even now like but it's easier it's so much easier to detangle my hair now now that I don't have two different textures completely like relaxed ends and then permed ends it makes it way more easier I don't even really wash my hair anymore in sections I can just go in and wash it but I'm still careful and then right here I'm going in with a wide tooth comb because I did use bigger sections and like I said earlier, I'm trying to hurry up and get it done and be done with deep conditioning because by this time, I'm tired. I'm ready to just stop and wash it out. Okay. So what I'm going to use first is to put this on. And then this, I'm going to heat up in the microwave. I'll be deep conditioned for 20 minutes. So I'll be back. Okay. Hey y'all, so I'm back. I just deep conditioned for about 30 minutes. Um, 30 minutes. I don't know why I just didn't put that on the sink. But yeah. It's all warm. Ooh. It's all warm and uh, nice. And I feel like I'm about to wash this out now. So I'm going to be back when I wash this out. And my boyfriend just came over right now. 
so that's what elongated it but yeah i'm about to wash this out oh this is so cute look at this <laughs> but yeah i'm about to wash this out y'all i know i keep saying that wash this out be back um yeah